Dipper and Salinas, as well as their Bodhi Day service. I want to thank all of you for joining us. Please make sure that your obutsudans are open, you have a candle lit, and incense burning as we begin today's service. I'll begin with the sutra chanting of the Sambujo, followed by a dedication reading, and then the Sambutsuge and the Jusege. During that time, we'll be scrolling the names of those observing Shotsuki in the month of December. When you see your family name, please go to your Butsudans and make an offering of incense. December of Shotsuki Hoyo, families have reverently come before Amida Buddha in memory of their beloved family members. With deepest reverence and thankfulness for the all-embracing wisdom and compassion of Amida, we reaffirm the three homages. I go to the Buddha for guidance. I go to the Dharma for guidance. I go to the Sangha for guidance. Namo Kiya Buts, Namo Kiya Ho, Namo Kiya So. Yeah. 
Thank you very much. And now I'd like to ask you to join me in the Gatha uh, Shinshu Shuka. And in your, if you have the large purple service book, it's on page 216. receive a human form, now we are living it. Difficult is it to hear the Dharma of the Buddha, now we hear it. If we do not cross over to the truth in the present life, in what life shall we cross over? Let us with sincerity and true reverence take refuge in the three treasures of the truth. I take refuge in the Buddha. May we together with all sentient beings awaken to the great way of enlightenment and to the unsurpassed intent of Amida Buddha. I take refuge in the Dharma. May we, together with all sentient beings, enter the storehouse of the Dharma, becoming like the wisdom ocean. I take refuge in the Sangha. May we, together with all sentient beings, become units in true accord in harmony with all things. The peerless, profound, and wondrous Dharma is rare to encounter, even in many hundreds and thousands of kalpas. Now we are privileged to hear and receive it. Let us thoroughly understand the true meaning of the Tathagata's teaching. Sankiyamon, Ninja no Kegatashi, Ima Sudeni Yuku, Puppo Kiki Gatashi, Ima Sudeni Kiku, Kono Mikonjo ni Wakate do se zumba, Sara ni Izure no Shou ni Wakata ka Kono mi wo do sen, Daishu Morotomo ni Shishin ni Sambo ni Kieshi Tate Matsuru Beshi, Mizukara Butsu ni Kieshi Tate Matsuru, 
まさに願わくは、市場とともに、大道を体現して、未行行こうさん、自ら法に消えし、立てまつる。まさに願わくは、市場とともに、深く教造に、知恵、海のごとくならん。自ら層に消えし、立てまつる。まさに願わくは、市場とともに、大衆を通りして一切無限のらん。無常人人未明の方は百千万語にも早うこと語し、折りま検問し、受事することを得たり、願わくは未来の真実義を下し立てまつらん。何万だうつ何万だうつ何万だうつ何万だうつ Once again, good morning, everyone.、Uh, thank you for tuning in today for our December Shotsky Horyo service.、Uh, when I was preparing my talk today, I was amazed that we're observing December Shotsky Horyo already. Time really does go by fast. And I'm sure for all of you, as you remember your loved ones, time has gone by and、uh, you may be telling yourself, Uh, as you calculate the years, that we say time has gone by so fast. And when we reflect upon all that has taken place since the time that your family members have died, it's a bit frightening. Probably what makes us think the most is how much everything has changed, how you have changed, how I have changed. We've all changed, and the world has changed so much. And、each day before I, as I go before the Butsudan here, I see you know, my, my family, my、uh, good friend, Reverend Hamada, and I think how much time has gone by and how much has changed. You know, when I think about my age now and how many years I've been living, I start to reflect back on events as far back as I can remember. And thinking about my career as a minister. And、uh, the other day I was remembering about a small boy that I had met、uh, while I was in Seattle doing services there. And this small boy was probably in middle school when he came for a memorial service. And his, this was for his grandfather who had passed away. And We talked about different things at the service, but also after the service. And it was surprising to me that this、uh, young boy, he said, you know, we were talking about music, and he said, Oh, I really like Eric Clapton. And I thought, Wow, this young boy who likes Eric Clapton. And、uh, many of you may know the story of Eric Clapton,、uh, he's a great musician. And his young son passed away. And he wrote a song. And I、uh, opened up the service with. Now, what's interesting about this song and about this young boy is that this young boy, he had expressed to me that he was worried that his grandfather wouldn't recognize him. His grandfather, who had passed away、uh, years ago, and the young boy was now、uh, middle school, and he was worried that his grandfather wouldn't recognize him. And it's interesting because Eric Clapton, despite the, the age difference of some 40 years, expressed the same concern, the same feelings. Our founder, Shinnan Shoni, also recognized this very natural concern. And he once wrote It's saddening that so many people, both young and old, men and women, have died this past year. But the Tathagata, Taught the truth of life's transiency for us fully. So you must not be distressed by it. Now, in this quotation, as the year is coming to an end, coming to a close, and a new one is approaching, Shinnan is getting melancholy. He's lamenting. You know, he's, in his, he's in his 70s or 80s, rather, when he wrote, wrote this. And he laments the passing of so many friends. So, in this one thought, Shinran 
equates death with transiency or change. In our daily lives, things are changing all the time. How many of us, though, are regretting change or fear change or skeptical of change? You know, in this world today, things are changing so fast. We all say we want change, but we want change on our terms. And it's hard to accept a change that is beyond our total control. So that is why Shinnan reminds us of what the Buddha had taught and says, so you must not be distressed. So this is important, Shinnan's message. Do not be distressed. Buddhism has always taught us that change is inevitable. And we fear change because we have no confidence or no trust or we are not wise enough to accept that change. So if I were to ask all of you, do you have trust in all the causes and conditions for this existence? You know, all of the, the things that people do for us, all the food that we eat, the shelters that we have, the clothes that we wear, all of these different causes and conditions for our existence. Do you trust in those things? If you have trust, then you can have confidence and accept the effects of all of our thoughts, words, and actions. And then life has meaning. There's a deep meaning, a deep feeling of gratitude for what we are receiving. If you have trust in your relationship with your family members whose names we scrolled on the screen, then we do not need to worry. We do not need to worry like this young boy or like Eric Clapton. Is. When we are small as children, we have trust in our parents. We have trust in things so we have the confidence to proceed. We move forward. My good friend, I recall him telling me about when he left home for school. And he was going far away. And he was going to be gone for a while. And then his mother said to him, try your very best. Try your very best. And if that isn't enough, if that isn't enough, remember, we always are here for you. You always have a home to come back to. Well, this friend of mine, his mother, passed away uh, a little bit after that. And he said, you know, now that the person that I love the most is gone, I realize that she is my role model for Amida Buddha. That even though I fail or change the world of truth that is Amida Buddha is there and continues to embrace me. This is a wonderful message for all of you who've lost family members. You are not alone. We all experience this. But they can be our role model for Amida Buddha that is teaching us this truth of life, this truth of change. So my friend and all of us, as we grow up, we have trust in our parents, in our mothers and our fathers, like Amida Buddha, always embracing us. And we don't need to worry. Trust in what we have received and how it continues to influence each and every one of us. So as you observe December Shotsky Hoyo, you know, uh, I do this service three times a month. I do it every month, and I think about all of you as you're observing these services, and I think it takes you back in time. It takes you back to the moment when you lost your father, you lost your mother, you lost your family members, and it's difficult. It's sad, but I hope you find comfort knowing that they're embraced by Amida Buddha. They themselves are Amida Buddha. Each time we say Namo Amida Butsu, they return to us. They are part of you and I, in our hearts and minds. You know, Shinnan said, and I'm paraphrasing, like the waves of Wakanoru Bay, I will return again and again. So each time you say the Nembutsu, Namo Amida Butsu, you are not alone. 
for I am with you. So each time we say Namo Amida Butsu, we are one with Amida. We are one with your family members. They return to you and are in your hearts and minds, teaching you this truth of life. So we should be holding these services as an expression of deep gratitude to them. Thank you very much. Please join me in that show. Namo Amida Namo Amida Namo Amida Namo Amida おねちどのかかんけのの向きは真理のもって本当すられそうろその故は諸々の造業を投げ捨てて一心に乱に君をすれば不可思議の眼力として分の偏りを上は自助さしめたもそのくらいを知念法器入所上司中とも尺子孫上の正明念部と柔和が往生定めたまいし今の人の念部と心べきなり花かしこ花かしこ新南少年たthat the essence of Jodo Shinshu is Shinjin. The reason is that by abandoning all of the practices and completely entrusting ourselves in Amida Buddha, our spiritual rebirth is assured by Amida through the inconceivable power of the primal vow. This is known as entering the ranks of the truly assured at the very moment of Shinjin. Thereafter, all utterances of the Nembutsu should be understood only as expressions of gratitude for Amida's assurance of our spiritual rebirth. With reverence, I remain. Namandalus, Namandalus, Namandalus. Thank you very much. Uh, before we close, I have a couple of announcements I want to make. I want to introduce you to our Watsonville virtual Sangha. With COVID restrictions, we still aren't able to hold Sunday services in person. But until our temple is open, your image can represent you virtually. Here's how to join our virtual Sangha. Submit a color photo of yourself by email, text, or drop it off at the temple office. You can even have a picture of one of your loved ones who is no longer with us. Suggested donations for your cutout is $50 for adults, $35 for children, $12 and under, $35 for seniors over 80. Proceeds will go to the Buddhist Education Fund of Watsonville. Help us fill up our hondo with our virtual sangha. See all those smiling faces, it's so great. Thank you very much. Coming in and playing bingo, I want to read to you the five bingo numbers for this week. First number is G47. G47. Second number, I22. I22. Third number, O71. O71. Fourth number, G49. G49. Third number, N45. N45. Good luck. If you have bingo, please contact the temple office. And um, I want to let you know that next week there will be no Sunday services, uh, but on the 28th, which is Monday, we'll begin streaming uh, some videos about New Year's. On Monday the 28th, there will be a video on uh, Mochitsuki, and then on Tuesday the 29th, there will be a video on uh, Shochikubai, and Wednesday there will be a the, 20, the 30th, there will be a video on Toshikoshi Soba, and then on the 31st, there'll be a video on uh, Ozoni and Sake. And then, of course, that evening at 8 o'clock will be the streaming of the uh, New Year's Eve service. And you can view that on this uh, same Chai Temple YouTube site. And then on the following day, uh, the 1st of January, of course, the 10 o'clock 
New Year's Day service. And finally, uh, right here in this uh, picture here, you see that we have the Watsonville Virtual Sangha. Um, you know, with the COVID restrictions, we still aren't able to hold services in person, but our temple is open, and your image can be seen virtually right here, just like that. And you can join this virtual sangha by sending a color picture uh, to the temple or email or text it or drop it off at the temple. And you can even have a picture of someone who's passed away. Join us. Suggested donations are $50 for adults, $35 for children under 12, $35 for seniors over 80. Proceeds from this virtual sangha will benefit the uh, Buddhist Education Fund. So uh, please join our virtual sangha and let's fill up our hondo with uh, pictures of it, all of us, or all of you. And now I'd like to close with the Gatha uh, Hondo San 2. Let's see here. The name in the original vow is the work of right assurance, the vow of the serene, sincere faith. It is the cause for birth, to attain the equal Bodhi, and to be enlightened to the great Nirvana are due to the consummation of the vow, assuring the unfailing attainment of Nirvana. Namo Amidabhutsu, Namo Amidabhutsu, Namo Amidabhutsu. Thank you very much, everyone. This will conclude our services today. Please stay healthy, stay safe, wear your masks, and we'll see you at on the week of uh, New Year's. Please be well. Thank you. <laughs>